Hey, what is going on? CC Cam here, you so winners, and welcome to Intelligent Design, an evolutionary sandbox. This is a game in the Jingle Jam Quick Play series, and I'm just going to get straight into it. That one looks good. Pretty good controls. Got a little of these games controller based. Congratulations oh, on your wow, that engineer. is some insane. Today's orientation will lay the foundations for a productive career. That sensitivity, though. Let's you change are controlling that. a drone on P5629 via satellite link. For increased employee satisfaction, we allow you to use a controller or keyboard to operate a drone. Horizontal motion is controlled using the left stick or WASD. Alright, so there is no way to really change controls in this. But you... I guess, do things with things. So I can press shift to go up and control to go down. And I can just fly around. Uh -huh. Let's try and toggle the force field on this thing. Anything else I can click on? Ooh, what's this thing? Oh, that's the edge of the force field. Right. So what if I make the force field smaller? I cannot go in the force field. Hmm, interesting. Totally just go over it though, that's not good. Yes. Unsure really what to do in this game, to be honest with you. I guess you've got to create a species of plants. Okay. Random plant. Oops. There we go. Uh, create, build a research station. So, buildings, research station. Insufficient biomass. Huh. Guess I've got to get a random plant again. A random herbivore. And a random. Let's just get a random everything. <laughs> and see what happens. We have found that productivity is increased by 23.7% when employees have clear targets. In the bottom right of the heads-up display, you can see three performance targets you are required to meet. These have been designed to assist you in designing an effective ecosystem on P5629. Hmm. Ooh, what's this? Oh, nice noises. Biomass from plants and the environment on P5629 can be processed and used to fabricate buildings and building upgrades. Request a collector to start collecting biomass. The range of the collector will be indicated on your heads-up display. It will harvest biomass from plants within this range. And... Yeah, our guys are doing pretty well. I suppose these guys are eating the other dudes. These will be our carnivores, these will be our herbivores. Still haven't got a clue what I'm supposed to be doing, honestly. Um, probably should have paid a bit more attention. Can I get a research station now? Insufficient biomass. Let's just spam random plants like crazy. And theoretically, when all of those have started, after dropping my FPS to like bugger all. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. How many biomasses do I need? Oh, I've got no herbivores. Let's try getting another set of herbivores. Random herbivores. Out of reach. Build more radars. Rip. Rip. God damn. Spam carnivores on top of them. That's probably not the best idea, but whatever. We shouldn't have any carnivores at this point because we've got no herbivores to eat. 
Because you need plants and you need herbivores and then these are doing pretty well, these cactus looking things. Where's the original ones we got? They're built over here, aren't they? Yeah, this is an interesting game. I've got no idea how it works. But these guys seem to be eating each other. Got a decent world efficiency. Can I sort of build insufficient biomass? I got 500 biomass. Right. Let's try some. Let's just go more random plants. Sorry about the lag. Just spamming some biomass. If I can get more biomass than there's a. Uh, Pretty good thing in it. Get some more herbivores now. Drop them in just there. Actually, drop some herbivores in here. Drop some carnivores in here. And fight! It's a weird game. If you like this sort of game, it's going to be great. It feels pretty good. So, yeah, if you like this sort of game, you'll probably be pretty happy with it. But if you don't have a clue what you're doing, you're not going to have a clue what you're doing. Ooh, that one just grew. Very nice. Research the first plant gene. Oh, no, that's normal. Genetics? Uh, science. Nope. Graph. Nope. I want to research something. Oh, I need to research station, don't I? Need the research station to research. So if we get some random plants. More random plants over here. I'm not sure if biomass is meant to be herbivores, carnivores or both. Or all three or just plants or whatever. So let's spam some stuff out. I want to at least get this plant, this research station. But my biomass doesn't appear to be going up. So I'm not quite sure what that's all about. But yeah, if I can at least get that, I'd be pretty happy with this world. Because this sort of game, this sort of game isn't really for me. Looks nice though. I like the graphic style they've gone with. It works for this idea. I hope everyone had a good Christmas. This is actually recorded after Christmas for me. This is the first one I'm recording after Christmas with a new webcam. Which, uh, in my opinion, looks very nice. New headphones. So I hope everyone did have a good Christmas or whatever holiday you celebrate or whatever. We're still not going up in our number of... Right, let's have a look at some graphs. So, our herbivore and carnivore population, they're going up and down pretty good. And our world score's going up. And our plant population is still going up. And yet, at the same time, we're not getting any more science. Why no random plants? Okay, let's do a load on top of this hill. Like an absolute buttload. Grow 100 wild plants, create a species of carnivores. Just killing my FPS here. But it's alright. World efficiency score. Let's get some herbivores next to them. They'll probably be eaten. I should just drop some herbivores down here. And then there's a big splodge over here. We can drop some carnivores. So that's pretty good. Our plant population is going down because I just dropped in a ton of herbivores. And then it goes straight back up because I just dropped in a ton. Ooh, music. Wow. Still no more biomass. That's weird. I don't know what I'm supposed to do, really, to get any more biomass here. I honestly haven't got a clue. I've got tons of everything. Look at this. This is awesome, but how am I supposed to get more biomass? Keep biomass, please. Buildings. You know what? Well, let's build a collector. Maybe I've got to build a collector. Oop. Buildings. Collector. Yes! Maybe I've got to build a collector. 
to be able to collect. There we go, my biomass is going up. Right, so you've got to build a collector. Let's have a look. 1.05 biomass. Oh, it's going up as well. That's good. So we're getting some good biomass now. That's how you do it. You build a collector, then you get biomass. Right! Makes sense now. So that's quite good. Maybe I've got... Is it got to collect it inside of that square? Because I did put it in the wrong place, if I do. However, at the same time... I can drop random plants on top of it. And some of them at least will survive. You'd have thought. How much is it saying that it's getting a second now? It's getting a lot per second now that I've dropped those on top of it, isn't it? Right, yes, yeah, so it's got to have stuff dropped on top of it to be able to do it. To be able to collect it. Okay. Right, we'll get a research station in a minute then. We'll build that, just because that's one of the that's the last challenge I've got down in my corner. Research a hundred wish a thousand plant science. Which is gonna take a little while. And I can probably drop it on top of this hill, I guess. Seven hundred and fifty. There we go. Let's A key it. mission of our organization is to understand the genetic Ooh. code of the organisms we are instantiating. Building research stations allows us to achieve this goal. Research stations will research organisms within their range. On plant science, no herb science. Hmm, nice. To incentivize research, we award engineers with biomass from central reserves. At the same time, the price of subsequent builds will increase. We are currently Game. deploying ecosystems on over a hundred worlds. The price increase is a measure put in place to relieve pressure from our production lines. I think I have found a cheat, kind of. Just spam as display. much as you can on the old random plants just here. And the research and the sensors will just do everything. Like, come over here if you want to research stuff. And just spam some herbivores. Spam some carnivores. The effectiveness of research stations can be increased by upgrading. Look at that. Point the crosshair at the research station and select the button which you use. We also find that more valuable research is produced as your organisms advance through their generations. Yep. The current generation of plants, herbivores, and carnivores that? are displayed in the top now, right of the heads-up display. Seventeen. Yeah, so that has been intelligent design. Uh, if you like this sort of sandbox, it's probably a pretty good one. Personally, I get a bit lost in them all, so yeah. But if you do like them, this one's awesome, and that's just growing. Nice. So thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one.